In tonight's Healthy Living, 11 days, 18 hours, 23 minutes, 52 seconds. The countdown is on for the August 21st solar eclipse, and eye doctors here are well aware. Do you anticipate that you're going to get people after the eclipse who've done eye damage? So we do anticipate that we'll see an increase in the number of people complaining about issues with their vision afterwards. Today at UC Health, I met a retina specialist who's been proactively talking to his patients about safe viewing of the eclipse, which is really, really important. He said, if you're looking at it with the naked eye, irreversible damage can set in after only seconds. Dr. Manry also told me suggestions that you can view the eclipse through something like the perforation of a Ritz cracker or a pinhole in a piece of paper are damaging. That's because you'd still have a column of UV light that could burn the retina. He explained the risk. So if you were to look for several seconds or, or minutes at a time, uh, you can have a little dark spot in the very center of your vision that may improve over the course of three or six months um, but oftentimes we see permanent vision loss that lasts the rest of your life. He told me the only safe way to watch the solar eclipse is with safety glasses like these that have an ISO standard. Beware of fakes. You know you have a bona fide pair when you can't see anything but the sunlight with them on. He advised putting them on while looking down before looking up at the sun.